people realizing and now seeing that's the person that he always was, you know, uh, taking care of his community, being a philanthropist and, and really promoting financial independence and the morals that he taught. Now, Taylor said he's met people from as far away as New York and California who've added our oh, man. Let me bring them up. Y'all salute. Salute. Tiptoe. What's good, my guy? What's up, man? What's up, man? Hold on. Let me put my headphones on. I'm tripping, bro. I'm tripping. Hold on. Let me put my headphones on, bro. What's good, bro? Talk to me, bro. Hey, what it do? Hey, what it do? What, what it look? Look, fam. Look. Look. Let's jump right into it, fam. Can you hear me? Yeah, I hear you. Okay. You froze up a little bit. Well, I'm going to say, uh, how you feel? Uh, you I hear you. Look, hey, fam. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. You, you skipping up. You skipping a little bit. You skipping just a little bit. Hit the, you want to hit the link and come back in? You want to hit the link? Hit the link and come back in, bro. Go out and come back in. Hit the link, come back in one more time. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hit the I'm gonna have him hit the link, come back in, y'all. We got a lot to discuss tonight, gang. He's gonna hit the link. I'm having him come right back in, y'all. Salute to everybody in the building, man. Salute to young Dolph, man. Salute to Tiptoe, man. You know, like I said, you take a real nigga, man, just to pick up a project like this, you know, and just start making show every single day. That you know you represent for young dog. Hold on, I got him back. I hold him back. What's good, fam? We back. It's up. It's great. We straight, bro. All right, be say no more. What's up, bro? What's good? Talk to me, fam. Now, what's going on with the young dog um, uh, uh, memorial, bro? What's going on with that, fam? I see you done put a lot of time and dedication and hard work into this, fam. Break down to me where you know where it all started, bro. Yeah, like I said in the, uh, in the interview on the news, man, it started out in. You know, after Dolph first died, man, this shit was this shit was so hard. You know, this shit was hard on niggas. You going down there and trying to, you know what I'm saying? Just being down there, like, man, this shit real. Nigga just coming to the to the reality, like, damn, nigga waking up. Yeah, they like, damn, man, dog dead. Like, like, damn, I'm to my bro, I do massage. I'm a massage therapist, but I got a, my flourishing business. I deal deal with a lot of people in my way book, but I couldn't go to work. I couldn't work, bro. I couldn't mind book no massages or none of that because my energy wasn't. My energy wasn't good. I'm in a my low end play, but that shit was so my such a curveball to the city, man. You hear me? To anybody so before. tell me this, tiptoe. Tell me this, bro. When did you, you know? How long have you been a Dolph fan, my nigga? You know what I mean? How long? I know you from Memphis, my nigga. How long you been jamming Dolph fan? My 2008, man. You hear me? Oh, uh, 2008, nigga. Damn, Dolph was 2008. Yup. Damn, man, nigga. I think this is this the I'm to my mind. Me see, niggas don't know. Niggas don't know. Everybody now that you can go viral with a song or something like that, and then when you go slap the shit out somebody, do some crazy dumb shit, you can get on. You hear me? Man, I'm talking about my thought took the bag that he had. Man, I'm talking about it flooded the street. The man flooded the street. It's CD every motherfucker. Where everywhere you go, you see nigga with paper route shit on and my dog world and shit like that. I'm talking about everywhere you went, man. You flooded the clubs out with CD with. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. So yeah, I've been mean, rocking with a nigga long, bro. For real. You got hold on. You kind of skipping around, but it's skipping around. We got a we got we got a bad connection, bro. We can hear you. I hear you good. I hear you perfect. Your audio is perfect. You just kind of skipping yeah. around, son. I'm finna go by my mind. Watch my bar. Yeah, yeah. You kind of skipping around a little bit. You know what I'm talking about? Only the camera. I, I hear you perfectly clear, though. I hear you good, my nigga. I hear you loud and clear. I hear you loud and clear. Yo, what about this? Let me see. Salute to everybody in the building. If y'all can see me, the nigga. See if y'all can see Just a see little bit, bro. I can hear you, my nigga. I hear you, but your, your, your picture's skipping and your picture's skipping around. If y'all can see. Yeah, hold on. This, you know what I mean? I'm going to come up. I'm, I'm going to pause it right there. If y'all can see the nigga, uh, the nigga Wi-Fi box. You know, his Wi-Fi box, R.I.P. Jeremiah, his Wi-Fi box was messed up. So, you know, we couldn't really get the interview off like we wanted. That was one of the main things about it. I remember him telling me was, I want to rock that hoe again, fam. You know what I mean? After he rewatched, he was like, let's, let's, let's rock it again. Yeah. <laughs> Looney, yeah. You feel me? Yeah. So, um, yeah, niggas is saying there's blood on my channel. This man, uh, Jeremiah Taylor, passed away in Memphis. Somebody shot him while he was in his uh, truck or something. I believe his, his car going somewhere. They say the news reported that somebody shot him. And now I'm hearing niggas saying that that's that's a case I'm going down for. You know, I'm I'm in I'm in Dallas. I do an interview. He gets shot in Memphis, and uh, now I'm, I I heard I'm on that indictment. Um, the Young Dolph indictment. I know niggas all around the world, nigga. I'm a real gangster. I've been everywhere, my nigga. I, you know what I mean? From every hood, damn near. 
uh, I know, I know, I know niggas on both sides of, of all that shit. You know what I'm talking about? And they say I'm 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 indicted for that. Um, the Mo Three case. Um, I, I was down here, you know, I rocked out, you know. Rainwater and rocked with a nigga on this channel too. Rainwater brought a lot to this motherfucking channel. Salute to that nigga Rainwater fan. You turned all these niggas up. Salute to Mo Three. You know what I mean? We was outside rocking with them niggas real hard. Rocking with HSM too, goddamn hard. The city was saying, "Sco, we feel like you letting them HSM niggas pull up over here and bang." We feel like it's a little gang war in the city, and you kind of yeah, your channel done chose sides, nigga, and you kind of letting niggas pull up doing some gang banging shit up on your channel, nigga. What niggas in the streets is telling me? Let's go watch how you handle yourself, fam. Watch, watch that nigga rainwater. Watch rain, nigga. Watch when rain gonna use you, nigga. They using that channel, fam, to bang on their ops and shit. You don't see what's going on, fam. That challenge, that challenge become the the the, the grounds for for gang banging and violence in Dallas. That's what I was being told by some niggas. A lot of other niggas said, "Nah, let's go. You you going hard? You doing your thing? You let people pull up and speak, nigga." But a lot of people said, "Nah, that channel." Has it's a lot of you know it's a lot of influence on that channel, nigga. It's a lot of shit going on with that channel. Yeah, yeah. Ghost on the short said they say you slid on King Von and FBG Duck too. Damn. Yeah, you know what I mean. So, um, yeah. Salute to everybody in the building, gang. Salute. Salute, man. You know what I mean? Um, I'm going to let y'all, you know, I'm going to let y'all ask me some questions tonight and shit. I'm going to let y'all, you know, pull up. Couldn't do this smoke session without my people, man. But, uh, you know, I want to say that, man. Um, yeah, if anybody, you know what I mean, if anybody want me to put the full interview up, you know what I'm talking about? And niggas say they got the screenshot of how long the video is. And so if niggas want me to put the video back out, y'all can say that. Jeremiah did. Jeremiah is no longer with us. Jeremiah wishes was that I took the motherfucker down. Niggas say I'm indicted on that though. Niggas say, you know, I got something to do with that trigger being pulled on Jeremiah Taylor. Niggas say me linking up with Anita Wilson's son, that was suspicious too. Niggas say Project Pat, one of the kings of Memphis, pulling up on this show. That was weird. I was, you know what I mean? Niggas say, nah, let's go. It ain't, this ain't a normal channel, bro. I've been being told for the longest the feds is watching my channel. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. For the last few days, I've been seeing the same car following me. I'm not even gonna fucking lie. I even walked up and tapped on a nigga window the other day and said, yeah, let's go. I'm talking about I'm, I was leaving. I think he fell asleep. I tapped on his window and told him, let's go. I've been seeing the same two white boys following me for the last nine days. So that's why I'm not going to let them make the move on me. I'm going to go ahead and make the move and turn my goddamn self in. Fam. I'm not going to, you know what I'm talking about? I'm going to turn myself in, bro. I'm not going to, yeah. Yeah. Real shit, I'm not, you know what I mean? Yeah, I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna sit here and cap to y'all. Same vehicle, same. The I'm gonna say this: the car ain't the same every time. But I've been noticing. Yeah, feds. Yeah, Cali Dre feds. When I go places, if I jump off a flight, it shit be getting weird. They always treat me. They've been treating me a little weird in the airports and shit like that. It's a lot of bloggers out there. You got 1090 Jake. You got DJ Academics. You, it's a lot of big bloggers out there. Nobody channel has ever do, done no shit like we've done over here, though, like far as all this shit. You've never seen a blogger ever get accused of the murders of the people he covered. We ain't never seen this shit in the history of this shit, man. This is, we ain't never in the history of the internet seen a blogger be accused of murdering rappers and setting niggas up and playing parts and all. We, this is the first time. This is This is it. This is the first time ever. I don't think we'll ever see this shit again either. Remember, somebody smoked Zach TV. Rest in peace to Zach TV. Somebody smoked Zach. They saying I'm doing all the smoking. They say I'm over a chain smoking and spinning and setting niggas up and taking calls and doing this and that. And they, 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 that's what I mean. But I'm here tonight to say, you know what I mean? Um, it is what it is, man. You know what I mean? Like I said, I'm not going to come here and lie to y'all. The bloggers, they doing their work. They not fucking around. They doing their thing. My ass is under a microscope. My channel is under the microscope. Fed snatched up the goddamn Instagram, they saying now. I got a weird message from a law enforcement, then the Instagram goes away. 
you know, I want to apologize to all the bloggers in the sector, man. I want every blogger. I'm getting like three, four hundred bloggers in the sectors and shit. Now I see a lot of y'all that came up off a lot of this shit I started. I want to apologize to y'all, man. I'm finna, you know what I mean? Actually, I, I gotta go. You know, I kept us in the headlines. I kept, I put us on TV. You feel me? I got the million dollar cookie deal. I showed y'all nigga live stream bloggers, man. We ain't nah, nah. We, we could rock with the big boys, nigga. I, you know what I mean, I was I was trying to prove something, but. Nah, absolutely not. Nah, nah, I, I proved my ass right to, you know, I mean, right, right to a goddamn Rico. That's what I did. I was trying to prove something. But you can't be connected to the streets and be a blog. I'm going to tell you that right now. You can't do it. I have an attorney. I have a good attorney. So when I get down, I'm not talking to nobody. I'm not doing no talk. Now, no YSL shit. To all my moderators, to everybody in my chat, I'm not on no YSL shit. When I get down there, I'm not speaking to nobody about nothing. I have an attorney. We going in and we trying to get right back out. If I can't get back out, we just going to sit down until we figure all this shit out. So I get extradited. When they extradite me somewhere else, we'll see if we can get a bond there. If I get a bond there, hopefully they'll send me back to Dallas. So if Dallas don't give me, you know, if Dallas don't give me a bond, they probably still going to extradite me. So you know what I mean? But at least I can get sent back to Dallas by bond out somewhere else. So I hope I get a bond somewhere else. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I'm gonna say this: every time something pop off, man, there's only one channel that could cover it the right way. It's only one nigga that's not gonna that's gonna be uh, unbiased. It's, it's only one nigga that's gonna really take you out here. It's only one nigga that's really gonna you know they'll speak the truth on shit, not you know claim to know who killed a nigga because I don't. How the fuck would I know who killed a nigga in a, in a case? If I'm not there, I'm talking about, I don't know how the rest of these bloggers do they shit. They cold blooded. Them niggas know how to, <clears throat> them niggas investigate without being on a crime scene, without actually talking to none of the suspects. Them niggas don't do no fingerprint dusting, nothing. But them niggas trying to solve murder cases online. And it looked like, you know what I mean? Uh, I, I, them niggas, I guess they know what they're doing. I'm talking about, I guess they, you know what I mean? Get the likes up. Salute to everybody in the building, gang. This is the last smoke out. This is it. This is it. If Dallas give me, if I get a bun in every city, then we back. We back like cook crack. If I go to jail and get my hands on a phone, we back, nigga. Let me go to, let me get my hands on a phone down there in the county, nigga. We back. We back, nigga. I get my hands on one cell phone, we going live, nigga. Right from the county. I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't gonna lie to you. I get my hands on a goddamn burner, nigga. We going live, fam. They can demonetize my channel. They can call the jail and tell on me, nigga. I don't give a fuck about it. I get my hands on another phone. I'm creating a new channel, a new email. I'm going live. Get the likes up. Yeah, y'all going everywhere with me, goddammit. I don't give a damn where I go. Y'all coming too, goddammit. You know, not physically, but yeah. Y'all going, y'all going, y'all be able to see it. Y'all, y'all see it. I want to apologize to the gang, man. I got to, you know what I mean? I want to apologize to the whole skull gang, man. I got to go away, man. I got to do, you know what I mean? I got to go sit down, but. Feel like I'm young thug and I'm like these bloggers. They're, they're burning them pussy. <laughs> they don't believe it. Or something. What's wrong with them, man? Right, right, right. You 